Hello and greetings, clan members and other YouTubers alike. This is Yoko25 again with another episode of uh, Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. And uh, from last we were, we just defeated the Water Temple, finally! And I was collabing with Lena, Lena Monster Bunny. Um, I'm going to put her link in the description. Um, what I'm trying to do is get the fire arrow. It's not working! Ah, uh, god damn it. Restore safe state. There we go. It worked. You gotta, you gotta stand right there, and then shoot it, and then it becomes a fire arrow. See, look at how shiny. Let's go get it. In the water. Fire arrow. Okay, now we got that. Alrighty then. What we need to do now is go. Actually, what we need to do now is catch up on some loose ends. So what we're what I'm going to do is this Go to the temple of time Oh, oh did it wrong. No oh, I don't know that song yet. Okay. All right, so I guess I'm just gonna hoof it <laughs> Just gonna hoof it back there. Let's put the green tunic back on Um, I've noticed in the past couple videos, I haven't gotten stuff that you need for, like, actually a necessity. Uh, stuff that you need that's actually a necessity. So, what I'm going to do is spend this episode catching up. So, and that involves me going back to the fire temple. So, let's just go do that. Uh, transition. Okay, now we're back in the uh, temple of time. So, what we're gonna do here is. Uh, let's hope Sheik's not here. Yep. Oh, Sheik is here. Okay, cool. Yeah, this is where he teaches me the song. You destroyed the wicked creatures that haunted the temple and awakened the sage. But there are still other sages who need your help. In order to awaken all the other sages, you must become even more powerful. You must travel over mountains, underwater, and even through time. If you want to return to your original time, return the Master Sword to the pedestal of time. By doing the travel back in time seven years. The time will come when you will have to return there quickly. I will teach you this. I will teach this to you for when that time comes. The song to return to you to the Temple of Time, the Prelude of Light. See, that's the song I was trying to play earlier. Right Okay, let's play. Quite a beautiful melody it is. Oh look at that! We got a star glowing in the sky. Wonder what that's from. Probably from when we played the song. You have learned the prelude of light. As long as you hold the Ocarina of Time and the Master Sword, you hold time itself in your hands. Yoku, we will meet again. <gasps> Epic departure! Sheik's a badass. Okay, let's go back in time! 
Back to child form. Alright. Now what I have to do is go to Zora's domain. Uh, know what? No, let's get... Let's get what we need here first. Yep. Let's get what we need here first. Okay. Go out of here. Oh, if I'm correct, that guy with the mask, that I mean the the, the guy that runs around Hyrule Field is going to be out there now. So, um I'll go deal with him soon, but probably not in this episode. And if I do, then Sure, let's just, let's just go with it. But, what I need to do now is climb over these. If you remember from a long time ago, there was that rock over there that we couldn't get by. Well, we can now that we have bombs. <laughs> so let's go do that. Boomerang for bombs. A hole. Oh, look, a fairy fountain. Let's play the royal knight, shall we? Come here, naked fairy. I need you to aid me. Naked fairy. <laughs> Only wearing leaves. <laughs> she was just laying there, it's like, hey, what are you doing here? <laughs> Look at me over here. I'm the great fairy of magic. I will grant you a magic spell. Please take it. Okay, go ahead and bend over for me, lady. I... Sorry. <laughs> Red glowy orb of power turns into dense fire. You got dense fire. Fireball engulfs everything. It, uh, it attacks magic. Um, it's attack magic you can use with C. You can use dense fire not only to attack but also to burn things. And that will be very useful in the next dungeon. So yeah, I did that for a reason. <laughs> Alright, now let's go get what else we need. Um uh, There we go. Go to Lake Hyrule. Yeah, you know what? I think I will do the Bunny Hood guy in this episode. Yep. Might as well. Like I said, this episode's just gonna be about catching up. So. Might as well go full on, huh? Oops. Didn't mean to do that. <clears throat> Let's keep going. I'm just trying to go to Jebba Jebba's place, so I'll cut to their uh, transition. Okay, we're at the Zora's Fountain. And look, there's Jebba. I don't care about Jebba right now. Let's go around Jebba. Or better yet, under him. If I can. 
can I do it? Go all the way under the big guy. Oh, nope. I can, I, <laughs> I can do that, though. <laughs> Not really what I wanted to do. Okay, but, eh. Alright, uh, where? Oh, over there. Okay. We're gonna blow up an entire wall here instead of a instead of a rock. This this uh, this one's a little bit harder to find, but I mean it's it's not really that hard. But I mean if you just know where to look. Okay, it's right here. So let's just put one of these right there. Boom! Yeah, whole wall's gone. <laughs> let's go in here. Another great fairy fountain! What else are we gonna get? Yeah, dense fire. <laughs> that would have helped me out a lot with, um... With... With Dark Link, because he can't dodge that. <laughs> mostly. He can't dodge that mostly, because, uh... He does often jump out of the way. If you if you spam it, like if you use it over and over and over again, he he knows what you're gonna do. So, I have great very magic again. All right. <laughs> this one is a big green orb. Of glowy majesty. And it's Ferrar's Wind. You got Ferrar's Wind. This is a warp magic. You can use to see it. It's totally useless! <laughs> you will teleport to the warp point when you first use the magic. You will create a warp point. When you use the magic again, you uh, either dispel the warp point. You can either dispel the warp point or create a last warp point. Or, or warp to the last warp point you created. Okay. I never used this thing. I don't even know why I got it. I just got it for, you know, percentage purposes. Remember, you can only use for something done just that you done it anymore. Hidden inside. Okay. Battle is made where we come back to see me. Alright. Link, you're such a player. Okay, that's done. Now, uh, let's just, uh, you know, cut to. Uh. Hyrule Field, and then we will go see if we can find the Bunny Hood guy. Transition. Alright, so Hyrule Field. It is now midday because I had to use a freaking song of, uh, Sun Song to make it work. So, <laughs> I mean, to make that gate go down. So, I had to use it. So, uh, alright, um, what we need to do is we need to, you know, try and run around and see if we can find this guy because he runs around the whole length of the Hyrule field and oh I think I found him no no it's just my eye playing tricks on me no no I think that's him yes it is it's him that's him all right and he stops at nighttime, so let's just follow him until it until it turns to nighttime. Yep, there he is. All right, cool. So, how's your day? No, go on, go on. I'm listening. That's interesting. That's interesting. Oh, really? You look beautiful today, by the way. I mean, if you're a man, well, you, you look you look very handsome. Yep. <laughs> yep. Okay, it's about to be nighttime. This thing's gonna try and kill me over there. Walk away from the deadliness, sir, please. Oh, Jesus. More deadliness. Alright, you know what? Just, just, uh, you know what? Fall down. 
Okay, guys. Let's just go ahead and kill you. Okay. Alright, now he's sitting. And we can talk to him. What you got to say there, buddy? In old times, I heard there were many rabbits in this land of Hyrule. Not anymore, though, because of the excessive hunting. I want to become a rabbit. Listen to the wind with those, ear those ears. Hop across the ground with those legs. Even if I can only pretend. Well, I think I can help you with that. Just let me kill these guys. Look at his, look at his face. Oh, no! Look at, look at his face. He's just like... Mm. <laughs> okay. Um, just go ahead. Whoa! Why do you not have a head? Okay. Now let's talk to him again wearing the bunny. <laughs> Tweaks. <laughs> I bet with those long ears, you can hear the voices. Oh! <laughs> those are generate rabbit ears. They're from the Animal of Legend. I don't care how expensive it is. Please sell it to me. My lifelong dream. Return to the wildlife. Finally, the actor and stage, the props have been united. He, look how he wears it. He, he wears it over his eyes. <laughs> it's a 50 degree Mac, but he paid a crazy amount of money for it. <laughs> More money than you can count. You rich bastard. Go back to the Happy Mask Shop and pay that back the amount of 50 rupees. Okay. And, and watch. Let, let's just kill these guys until morning. Till, till morning comes. Watch. Hey, you know what? Screw it. Watch how he just takes off. And zoom! Yeah! He is zooming. <laughs> he just takes off. Look at that guy! Gonzo, man! <laughs> wow. Alright, let's go back to Happy Mask Shop. Mm. Inside the market. Oh great, you solved it! Please pay me 50 rupees for the, the bunny hood now. Oh yeah! Very well done! All of the masks are sold out. I know I can trust you! As a reward, I will lend you this special mask! This is a mask of truth. It is a mysterious mask passed down by the Sheikah. With this mask, you can see into people's minds. It's useful, but scary! Why is it scary? You may find out as you grow older and discover the true meaning of life. Ho ho ho! <laughs> I haven't done that voice for a while. You borrowed the mask of truth, where it was seen, show it off, and yeah, show it to many people. Alright. You can borrow any mask you want. Just leave, just have faith. Oh, that was his voice, man! Okay. Look at these masks I can borrow now. Got the Zora's mask, the uh, Gerudo mask, and the Goron mask. These two will be very important in the, the kind of sequel to this game, I guess you can call it. I won't play that one, though, because it is just... I don't even like it. Okay. Alright, I guess that's all I'm going to have time for today, guys. Uh, like and favorite if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to become part of the Hill Clan today. And I'll see you next episode. See you later, guys.